All right, so the pipe right here is cracked. It's cracked right, probably right below the concrete. I can see it on my camera, which is crazy. Uh, and the pipe runs this way. Okay, so we need to jackhammer from here, back this way, around this pipe, and probably over here by this pipe, so that we can reconnect everything now. I'm gonna cut this pipe up here. I'm gonna lower this down to here, so that it's accessible and usable. I want to redo the pipe and PVC and connect it over here somewhere. We may have to tunnel a little bit, but it's not going to be too bad. Uh, pipe's about a foot and a half to two feet deep. We're all going to replace the toilet flange. Uh, it's all the way up here. You can't really see it, but it comes right off of this pipe. There's a, a Y for the sink, and then over right here is the toilet flange. I'm going to show you that upstairs because I have the toilet off. The toilet flange is too low. One of the wings is broken. And the toilet's been rocking, and so I'm gonna set it, but you guys are gonna have to redo it, obviously. And so, and so here you go. You can see it's an old ABS flange with a metal ring. You can see the spanner flange right here, and this needs to be lifted up uh, so that it's above the grade of the floor. And then we need a new supply line, so it's a longer one. If I if it's steel here and I can get it to fit, then I replace it. You don't need to replace it. Um, and then normal wax ring, and then we need to caulk it with clear caulk. Okay, clear caulk around the toilet. That will really lock it in place. Um, we'll be good to go.